You know what? Yesterday I saw a really ugly fly that wouldn't stop bothering me. Olga, every fly is ugly and they also smell bad. How disgusting! A big fly with hair all over the place? I don't know what they're good for. All they do is bother you. Well, just like you, Rita. You're like a fly. You do nothing but bother us all the time. Me? That's not true at all. Uh, 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 uh. You are a stinky fly. And you're like a green booger. That's so gross. A green and stinky booger? Quit biting, you two. You're like two flies that do nothing but fly around and fight. But she's the one who started it. No, you're the one who started it. Hi there. Why are those two fighting? Ah! A spider! Somebody help me! Ah! Where's there a spider? Spiders gross me out. Go away, bug! <laughs> I just wanted to say... Yeah, yeah, whatever you say, but just go somewhere else. Okay, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Go far away, dear. Real far away. Make sure we can't see you. Did you see how hairy and ugly she was? I don't know if she was ugly or not, but I'm really scared of spiders. She was really ugly, and we don't want her around us. Hi! What were those screams that I heard? There was a spider right there, and it scared us half to death! It scared you? <laughs> spiders are harmless. They only attack when they feel threatened, just like bees do. Whatever you say, but it was a red, ugly spider. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Red and ugly? I hope you don't mean little spider. Who is little spider? Little spider is my friend. She's a really nice and funny spider. I hope you weren't mean to her. She's a very good friend of mine. Uh, yeah, but we didn't know she was your friend. But it's a... a hairy spider. I can't believe it. You cannot judge anyone before you get to know them. I'm going to look for her, and when I find her, you should apologize. Oh, dear. We really were mean to Little Spider. Yeah. If I had known she was Milo's friend, I wouldn't have been so mean to her. It still makes my skin crawl, but I'm going to try to talk to her. Little Spider! Little Spider! Where are you? Don't pay attention to what my friend said to you. You're my friend, and I want you to come with me. My friend said they want to apologize to you. Little spider, don't hide. Let me explain. I never want to see your friends again. They were all really mean to me. Little spider, I'm so sorry, but my friends are really nice. It's just that they're afraid of, of things they don't understand. But I told them you're my friend, and from now on, they're going to be nice to you. Are you sure they won't get scared when they see me? I assure you. Come on, climb on my arm and let me introduce you. Here we are. <clears throat> <clears throat> Little spider, I'm very sorry for what we said to you before. I just got scared. Will you forgive me? Of course I forgive you. I know that you're good friends of Milo's, and he told me that you're nice to all the other animals. I... I... just wanted to say I'm sorry for the mean things I said to you. I hope you'll forgive me. Yeah, I feel the same as Mimo. End of story. I forgive all of you. You see, little spider? Now you have some new friends. Well, now that we're friends, I'm going to tell you a joke. A joke? A spider telling a joke? I can't believe it. Mm. Rita! What is red and dangerous? Strawberry jam with the tarantula. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> a good one.
one, little spider. Can you tell us another one? What do you get if you mix a rose with a tarantula? I don't know, but you better not try to smell it. <laughs> Now it's my turn to tell a joke. But you're no good at telling jokes, Moo Moo. What do you mean I'm no good? I am great at telling jokes. I'm sorry, Moo Moo. The truth is that we never understand your jokes because you start laughing before you finish telling them and then you never finish them. This one you'll understand for sure. It's really good. Why did the chicken cross the road? Mm, I don't know, Moo Moo. To get to the other side. <laughs> it's excellent. <laughs> Did you get it, huh? Come on, don't go. I want to tell another one. I couldn't sleep at all last night. Me neither. The only thing I heard all night long was Moo Moo snoring. We've got to do something about it because I couldn't take another night like that. We could sleep out in the garden inside a tent. I got it. Why don't we build a treehouse and make Moo Moo sleep there so we can finally get some sleep? Poor Moo Moo. It's not her fault she snores so much. She has a bad cold. Fine, whatever the reason is, we still have to build the treehouse. Don't you agree? All right, let's go get everything ready. My friends, as you all know, Moo Moo hasn't stopped snoring, and we haven't been able to get sleep at all. So we're going to build a treehouse so we can get some sleep and relax. I thought Alfred was the one that snored. Excuse me, Rita, but you should know that I don't snore. I breathe with style. Whatever you say, Alfred. We have everything ready to start building it. So everybody do what Milo says. I want my own room with a double bed and three mirrors. I don't know why you want so many mirrors when you always dress the same. Ahem, what are you saying? Are you insinuating that I don't have style? No, no, that's not what I meant. Of course not. Milo, whenever you want, we are ready. Well, fine. The first thing we have to do is get everyone up top. Let's get on the platform. Good. Now everybody get to work. Rita and Olga, you can start building the walls. Talalo and Alfred will prepare the ladder. I'll help out wherever I can. Hello, my friends. Hey, what's going on? Mumu, what are you doing here? Shouldn't you be doing your homework? I already finished. What are you doing? We wanted to surprise you. We built a house just for you up here in the tree. <laughs> Thank you, but I already have a house. Why would I want another? Moo Moo, the problem is that you snore like a lion and we can't sleep with all that snoring. So we built you this little house so that you could sleep here. You're throwing me out of my house because I snore? <laughs> I'm so sad. But we all need to rest. And with all your snoring, none of us can sleep. <laughs> I'm so sad. You don't want me to sleep with you in the same house. You don't love me anymore. Moo Moo, we're sorry. I'll tell you what we'll do. This house is for all of us, and we're going to sleep here all together starting tonight. Am I also going to sleep here? We're all going to sleep <gasps> here. You'll see how uh -huh. much fun it'll be. Come yeah! on, quit crying and help us finish it.
Thank you, friends, for this beautiful house. And don't worry, because I promise I won't snore tonight. Not even a little. Alfred! Quit snoring! I'm not the one snoring. It's Moo Moo! What can we do to make her quit snoring? We can make that noise that people make when somebody's snoring. I know which one. It sounds like she stopped. Finally. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. night. Good night. Alfred! Make that noise again, really loud this time. Let's see if she shuts up. Alfred? Alfred! Alfred fell asleep. I can't believe it. Now Alfred is snoring. Now Rita is snoring. This is a nightmare. Now you're snoring too, Milo? You know what? I'm gonna go home now so I can sleep all by myself. Good night. <laughs>